Hello everybody, welcome back to part 2 of the review of the um, Samsung Galaxy Reverb from Virgin Mobile USA. Um, if you haven't already, please check out part 1 for the basics and, well, the rest of this review. Um, <clears throat> Alright, so let's start out with the camera. There's a dedicated camera button on the side there, so that's very nice. And um, we'll just go basic here. Uh, you can see camcorder, it's HD 720p. And I will have, well I do have, a sample uploaded to my YouTube channel, so just check that out. Um, for the camera though, you can tap where you want to focus. So let's just say we want to, let's just say we want it to focus on the side of the picture. Well you can tap there, oops, and take our shot. And also it does have a flash, um, and you can also use the button on top, so you could say focus it over there, and then take the picture. And the camera overall was really good. Um, you can check out video samples from that on the, um, you can zoom in like this really easily. You can check out uh, photo samples, I mean, on uh, from actually the front facing camera as well, um, on my Facebook page. Um, Please like the page while you're there. Uh, it is www.facebook.com slash fun01. Uh, you can get updates and extras on there uh, from my video and channel. Um, okay, so pictures looked great on the screen. Um, you can see uh, you can see the one we just took. Um, let's see what else we've got. And it's the video. Okay, I was needing pictures there, but you can see. Uh, pictures actually do look really well, or really good on here. And you can zoom in. Um, <clears throat> Alright, and then... Uh, yep, and then a camcorder sample will be on my YouTube page, or is on my YouTube page. Um, also, let's check out games on this phone. Um, it's got a 1.4 gigahertz processor, and it also has a graphics processor, so it's set for games. Um, what I downloaded, I downloaded a um, Deer Hunter Reloaded. It was free, and it was 275 megabytes, and that's why I got it, just to see how well it did with a huge game. So basically, if it plays that, it'll play anything, and it played Deer Hunter just fine, no lag or anything. Um, I also did get Temple Run and Mega Jump, and um, they all ran very well, as, uh, very smoothly. No lag. I'll just do Temple Run real quick, because that's one that is a favorite right now. Oh boy. Um, so again, there's really no lag. It's very smooth. Um, let's see. We'll play this. Again, I can't really see what I'm... Things are kind of laggy when I'm looking through my camera, so... I don't expect to do really well here. But, yeah. Again, though. No lag at all. Brings up the menu again. And just like that. So, this is a very good phone for games. And a nice 4-inch screen uh, makes it quite easy. Sorry for the noise in the background. Uh, it's my other phone. I didn't turn it on silent, and it's giving me notifications. Um, okay, now let's check out Speed Test and Quadrant. Um, let's see, here we go. Here's the Speed Test app. A little bit about Speed Tests. Um, uh, I'll show you some results. My area is usually about, well, it varies so much from anywhere you are, but this is just about on par with other phones I have in the area. So, um, you can see any of them with that sign up there are from cellular. Um, so again, not horrible. Um, you're com I'm comparing those to other speeds I get on other Virgin mobile phones in my house. So, uh, they're not bad for my area. Um, I always get faster results when I'm in town. So, uh, again, I didn't really bring this phone in town much. Um, so, speeds were pretty average. And uh, signal is average to low as well. Again, you can see it's on 1x for some reason. It'll come off in about a minute, I'm sure. But uh, signal wasn't the greatest. But 
Um, call quality was fine on both ends, and we will run a... Uh, we can't run a speed test if it's on 1x. We'll come back to that, maybe. Um, but right now, let's do quadrant standard. <clears throat> um, Alright, run full benchmark. Oops, did I click it? Oh. That's not good. What a perfect time for this phone to lag and quit responding. I have to say, it's really never lagged on me or quit responding. Uh, okay. Alright, we'll try this again. Uh, quadrant. Yeah, there we go. And you can watch this. Sorry about the reflections. I still haven't figured out how to get decent lighting and not have reflections. Um, I'll tell you about Quadrant. I've run it two times before, and I'll spoil it. I got a score of 2,561 the first time and 2,656 the second time, which are both pretty dang good. Um, again, this phone is not dual core or anything, but with ice cream sandwich and a one point. Uh, 4 gigahertz processor, it's not very bad. Um, it's pretty well off. And again, doing games, it works just fine. So, don't even ask about games if you're going to get this phone, because I'll just tell you that they work fine. Uh, Alright, we'll just wait for this to finish up then. Uh, something to note about the screen on this phone, I have the brightness all the way up right now. Um, I notice this mainly when I'm outside with the camera. Um, it always seems to be uh, not very bright of a screen, so that's something to note. Um, it's only a huge deal when you're outside trying to take pictures or do something. still on 1x, and that's what's taking it so long. Uh, let's see if we can get any better service. Come on. Why is it that when I'm doing my review, that's always the time that a phone goes on to 1x? Like, usually it's not on 1x. Usually 3G's just fine. Okay, here you can see the results. Um, this time I got 2,627. So about on par with my last two results and let's see if we can get it so you can see that well it's the one your device right there so again the one x which is at the top is a very good new phone and uh... the hx 4g is there the galaxy tab which is a tablet is just above this phone um, the galaxy nexus a great phone is right below it optimus 2x desire hd Samsung Nexus S. So really, this phone is up there in the in the quadrant test. And now I'll run back to speed test and try it one more time since it's on 3G. All right. Again, not too much service, and I'm in the middle of the country here, so I can't expect too much. And it is uh, about the time of day when the service may be busy, so... Okay. Again, I just do this live because I enjoy watching them. Um, but uh, it will vary from place to place and time of day. Uh, for what speeds you'll actually get. Alright, well that's that. Now, overall, 
this is a great phone with new specs that uh, can compete with current phones and the price is not too bad. Um, so I really do recommend this phone. Um, $250 again is not much at all for this off contract. Um, and also please follow me on Twitter um, at funzier one and please subscribe to me on YouTube that really helps. And you can always text me questions at my text plus number, which I will have below on the screen. And also, I recently created a Facebook page, so please like my Facebook page. You can get photo samples there, and um, just news and updates, and I'll answer your questions on there. Um, that is facebook.com slash funzier1, and thanks for watching.